Welcome back to another episode of School of Early. Now, most of us are taught traditionally to hold the blade in this hand, left, in this manner. Some of us are a little weaker, some of us are bad in technique. But what if there was another way of intubating? So, Dr. DeCanto taught me a way of intubating that if you're in a confined space, you no longer perhaps have to be in a fighting stance like I've been teaching you, but perhaps a more narrow method. All right? And the method that you would cry, uh, almost crawl or approach the patient like a crab. Now, my bougie is my friend, so I'm, I try to use the bougie more as much as possible. Don't like the stylet. And this is a better version of a stylet. Um, easier success, higher success rates with intubation like this. Uh, so, but what if I approach the mannequin? Not like this, but like this. Using the force of pulling up. It's a lot natural to pull up this way than pulling up this way. The natural tendency is to rock the wrist. It's kind of hard to rock the wrist this way, and it's a lot easier to pull away this way. So, again, the demonstration. I'm going to intimate crab style. The mouth. Utilize my other techniques. Two the molecular, simple glass, put two the molecular. See, similarly, do some ECM. A lot better with ELM, but no one's here to help me. So I'm going to utilize my bougie. Yeah, let's see some of the posterior cartilage, part of the course. Come into it. So for those who say there's only one way to do things, what if we all started with the crab method? And then some maverick came up with the way of intubating this way. We'd be looking at them funny. So I don't have a malady or an ailment that prevents me from intubating the traditional way, but I do know that if I do get the same success with patient safety, no damaged uh, lips, no damaged teeth, and I get the two in as fast or faster than my colleagues, all that matters. No DSAT, first pass success is name the game. I'm going to leave you with those thoughts. Please come back for another episode of School Early. Bye-bye.